Hey, everyone, we are back at Wine Up Wine Merchants, and look at my man, Wayne the Wine Wizard. Now that, my friend, is a glass. Go I'm big honest. or go home. Uh, That's how we roll here. There are daily deal. We'll tell you about that coming up in just a bit. But, you know, you have these great classes. You have these great wine tours where people learn about the wine industry, specifically here in the Northwest. What is it about this area that makes us a wine mecca? You know, it's the Willamette Valley. It, it's a, formed by the Missoula floods. It's a great place to grow cool weather grapes. You have Pinot Noir, Pinot Gris, Chardonnays, Rieslings, uh, Pinot Blancs. It's an amazing place for these style of wines. You can't grow these kind of grapes in eastern Washington or in Napa. It's just too warm down there. So when you look at wines and you look at the varietals, they're site specific. And you know, you talk about different clones, you different rootstocks, different soil components. That's what creates the flavors inside the wines. All right, now walk me through a, a wine lesson here with the wizard. Not everyone's going to have a glass. I've got glass envy right yeah, now. Do you have glass envy? So walk me through the process here. How do you how do you test out this uh, vino? And well, you know, basically the first thing you have to do is smell the wine. Okay. All right, stick your nose in it. Well, yours has plenty of room for that. It does, doesn't it? I know that, right? And yeah. then, of course, uh, taste the wines. you got to bring it up into your mouth. Okay. <laughs> It'll get there eventually. There you go. And you kind of swish it around a little bit? Swish it around and you swallow it. You know a good wine after you swallow it. If it lingers in your mouth, it's a really good, good structured wine. Now, there's a lot of things. You know, people always ask me, what food's good with what wines? Yes. A wino wallet wizard. I so, love this. Uh, yeah. So it says here, you know, for a Cabernet, what kind of seafood would you have with that? What kind of meat would you have with that? Exactly. And for every different type of wine. Red wines are in the front, white wines in the back. Yeah, I can put these away uh, on my, on my uh, classes and my tours. And um, I also have a wine club, and I'm launching in about two weeks. It's it's not like your ordinary wine club. I focus on a different country every month, a different region within that country, and a different grape varietal. So it's a it's going to be a book. You're going to have a starter kit, and you're going to be able to put pages into it and really build your wine drinking experiences. Very nice. Now, folks, you need to log on to kptv.com today because it's our Fox 12 Daily Deal. You can participate in one of the Wine Wizards classes, uh, classes right here at Wine Up. Uh, it's going to cost you 20 bucks. That's 50% off. Normally, it's 40 bucks. You're going to sample about six to nine different wines. you got some appetizers and the educational and the entertainment provided by the wizard himself. Uh, thank you so much. It's been a lot of fun. Jeffy, Appreciate thank you, it. Man. You got it. And, guys, that's going to wrap it up. And for his final trick, the wizard is going to make this wine disappear. Let's send it back wow. in the studio. Uh, which I mean you drink. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs>